so um, Alex is still asleep and Anne is left for work so I can talk to you for a few minutes. So hey! One of my kids, um, I gave them a poetry test um, on Monday and one of my kids analyzed this poem that was about a person that had this connection to a tree and um, most of the people when they interpreted it like were specifically about a man because the author was a man and just because it's a pretty male class there are a lot of guys in it this one girl she wrote this really really sweet interpretation of a little girl who fell in love with the tree and it was just it was so lovely and I'm just I'm it made me very happy but I think that's why we need more I think we need more diversity because yeah some kids will write themselves into a character and write themselves into a story but a lot of them won't or will be encouraged not to because they'll be told they're wrong and we need to have a diverse amount of characters it's just so important one of i was talking to one of my kids and i asked her what her favorite um story was and she has a scar on her face and she started talking about this book that i listened to on a road trip with my family once about a little boy named augie who has some kind of scar on his face and it just uh, it reminds me how important it is to have diverse characters so that students can find themselves in characters because that's the only way they're going to learn to love reading otherwise it's just going to get boring because they can't put themselves into this story because they aren't in the story they're not included in the writing and it's just it's something I'm realizing how important it is and it's just we need to stop reading books with the same characters because if we keep encouraging this system of white male boys with dogs I don't know if you saw that news story about a little girl that collected a thousand books about a character other than white boys with dogs because <laughs> that's great she's the best but yeah we need to we need to encourage diversity in books by supporting books that are not about white boys with dogs anyway that's my thought of the day see you tomorrow